Hi, I'm uh, Yeno from Ufch. Um, hello, I'm Catherine from the same Ufch. I grew up with classical music, did jazz, did electronic music, and now doing this, which is basically like the whole thing mixed into one. I do a lot of like pushing buttons during the show and trying to improvise the show and like see how, of course you, you kind of like get the reaction from the crowd, but it's also like very busy doing act the actual work, trying to make something like sound as cool as you can, like in this very second of like getting the bass sound perfectly right or getting this beat to be very groovy or anything like that or changing it up. It's just for me also being like very interactive with the crowd. Um, but it's also, I mean, like I, me as a person, I find it very hard to have like a stage banter, like, hey everyone, we are Earth and it's just strange. Like, it's rather we prefer not, I'll, I might say three or four words in an hour and that's kind of fine. And like, like in some ways to keep, you know, this environment in this world without me going, and now the next thing is, thank you for being here. No one cares. They just want to hear the, the music, I suppose. But obviously it's that's totally awesome when you feel that the crowd likes the music, yeah. that it definitely yeah. feeds into our vibe and what is what we're going to do and like how great the show is going to be. My acting is always like just oh, like funny. just like being as still as possible whereas <laughs> you're doing all the acting. I cannot act like it's very difficult for me so I just kind of just try to not do anything. I, I, but it's not actually about like the acting, why the videos are how they are. I think it's more like I'm much more emotive than Jens's. I mean, he's Danish, first off. Um, but he's just not really, Im yeah, or really? no emotion. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, also, I think you like that the fact that you come from that whole acting, but also just film buff thing, like you watched like every single film probably ever made almost I so did. you I know like not. just the fact like many more than i have uh i think they said the same thing about rock and roll and jazz and uh, you know like it's not the, the machines are not it's what you put into them obviously and and i think that moving into the future is where this is electronic music like the whole and everything new is app that's happened within the past like I don't know how many years has come from that from computers. Yeah, you wouldn't have Prince. You wouldn't have Tom York. I mean, these are like big like you know, musical forces. And if you know, if you took away all of that kind of stuff, I don't know. I mean Yeah, it's all they, about like they wouldn't have a voice in like a, they would have a voice in the tap and web course, but you know It's all about how you're using the computers. Yeah. And if people don't like dubstep, you know, like, that's fine, but that's that's just a, a taste choice. Obviously, dubstep is something that's a new genre that's been invented within the past, I don't know, 10 years. Right. <laughs> Great.